Brian. And uh, it's called, it's not called Brian, it's called I Don't Care. I don't care about their hair or the clothes they wear, ill-fitting or not, so what? I don't care about their size or their thighs in those boots or if they wear cheap suits. If their skirt's too short, or their bra's all wrong, or if they should have worn a thong with that dress, or if they look a mess, I don't care. If his jeans are too young for his age, if he doesn't suit beige, if he looks better in blues, but not in those shoes, I don't care. Unless um, I'm going out with them, because then ultimately they are a reflection. <laughs> <laughs> For the record, I did like Brian besides that. that <laughs> his personality. Um, I wrote I wrote this one um, today actually, um, and it's called I Wonder, and it's about Theresa May. Um, yeah, I just it's too heavy for me. <laughs> don't really understand, so I wrote about it. It's called I Wonder. Theresa May. What can I say? <laughs> Theresa May. <laughs> Theresa May. Is this a dream? Am I in a self-published dystopian novel? <laughs> Theresa May. When she was younger, I wonder, did she say, when I grow up, I want to be the unelected leader <laughs> of a right-wing government responsible for the destruction of the welfare state. <laughs> As she grew, do you think she ever knew she'd carry the mantle for so much fear, hate and suffering? <laughs> Would it break her Christian heart to learn that Jesus was a socialist. <laughs> Does she have a heart? <laughs> Does she feel guilt about the blood on her hands? No one ever thinks that they are the baddie. How can we make a see? That poem as well was, I was watching um, when they had the um, Tory party conference, it was on telly and they interviewed some young people and they did think they were the goodies and it really blew my mind. I was really like confused by that. Um, they thought they were the good guys. Yeah. I think there'll be a part two, three, four, five, six, and seven. I reckon it's drugs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, part, sorry, part drugs. Um, okay, that make you think you're the goody. Um, this next poem isn't called I Wonder, it's just called Jeremy Hunt. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what you're going to We'll see where I'm going. And you might guess where I'm going with this, but it's the truth. <laughs> Jeremy Hunt, you bear the brunt of the NHS like it is nothing. Named in the suicide note of the junior doctor, still no weight on your mind. You sleep like a baby. Her name was Rose Polge. Forging on against the wishes of millions. Like it's yours to do with what you want when it's not, it's ours. Forcing it to its knees so you can say the only humane thing to do is kill it. Jeremy, hunt and kill and feast. Profiteering from pain, illness and death. Health a privilege of wealth. A privilege I couldn't bear if my sister couldn't have it. Jeremy Hunt. I know they call you Jeremy Cunt. I don't like it. Cunts are givers of life. <laughs> um, um, this is going to be my last one because I've lost my poetry book. Um, and this one, um, this one is about 
confidence really and who we'd all be if, if we had confidence um, and it's called imagine <coughs> imagine no one ever told you it wasn't possible imagine no one ever told you you were wrong Imagine no one ever laughed at you, dancing and singing and dreaming. Imagine no one ever ignored your curiosity. Imagine no one ever told you to be quiet. Imagine you still believed in yourself. You could run and run with your kite trailing on the floor and believe in the power of your laughing knees and take flight. Just imagine. Thank you very much. Yay!